this is how to get the CS2 jump bind and auto exec. What you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and make a text document on your desktop. I name it auto exec. I'm going to open it up. Open, go ahead and uh, copy and paste the commands I have in the description. I have these on my desktop, so I'm just going to go ahead and copy them. So I copied them over. This one is your jump throw. Just replace whatever key that you're going to be using for the jump throw to yours. And then this is, if you guys want this, it'll be in the description too, it is uh, the FPS and the internet uh, commands for uh, CS2. Once that's done, you can go ahead and save it. Save it to your desktop. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and open up Steam. Once Steam's open, you're going to right click on CSGO, hit properties, go to installed files, then browse, then game, then CSGO, then config. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take that folder, which is the auto exec, you're going to drag it in here. You're going to rename it. Name it to whatever you want it to be, but I'm just going to put auto exec. And then you're going to change the .txt to .cfg. I already have mine in here, but just go ahead and hit yes if you already do. Then once that's done, go to the same uh, Counter-Strike uh, property screen. And you're going to go to launch options. And you're going to do plus exec auto exec or whatever the name of your file is. Once that's done, go ahead and boot up CS2. Go ahead and hop into a practice uh, match. Now, once you're in a practice match, go ahead and click all the bots, buy smoke. This is a jump throw for a connector. And just go ahead and pull the pin and then hit your jump throw. This is how you can get consistent smokes in CS2 so you don't have to worry about missing smokes.